Now, let's connect the range to propane. Apply gas PTFE tape to the half-inch NPT. Tightly secure the adapter to the inlet pipe set with a wrench and slip joint pliers. Do not over-tighten. You'll need a CSA internationally certified flexible metal appliance connector to connect the range to the gas supply line. The hose should have an outside diameter of 5 8 of an inch and a maximum length of 5 feet. Never reuse an old connector when installing a new range. To attach the gas line, remove the line plug and attach the other nipple with some gas PTFE tape. Use an adjustable wrench with slip joint pliers, being careful not to over tighten. Attach the hose to the nipple and tighten with an adjustable wrench and slip joint pliers. Be careful not to over tighten. When all connections have been made, check that all range controls are in the off position. Then turn on the gas supply valve. Check all gas connection joints and fittings for leaks with a non-corrosive leak detection fluid or soapy water. Then wipe off. Make sure the burners are off, then plug the range into the outlet. Please note that a power cord is supplied with gas models, but dual fuel models are not shipped with a power cord. Make sure you have the correct three or four wire connection for the install location.